easily beat the Dagger Dodge's challenge with this deck. This challenge goes up to 12 wins and you have to build a deck using the brand new tower troop, the Dagger Dodge's. Now the Dagger Dodge's is very unique. This tower troop has a bar. This bar shows you her ammo and when the bar is full, you can see she can fire out daggers very quickly. She has a super high fire rate, but when that bar is empty, she then has to reload and her fire rate goes way down. It takes her a very long time to start shooting. This means she's very good against cycle decks, but bad against beatdown. So with that in mind, the best deck for this challenge is Pekka Bridge Spam. If that bar is low, you want to spam your opponent. You want to pressure them and take advantage of them pretty much not having a tower. We do only have one evolution slot in this challenge and we are using the Evo Zap. Okay, we are now 11 and 0. Let's play this final game together to see if we can get to 12 0. Okay, into a game and first play we are going to Royal Ghost at the bridge, doing that just to force our opponent to do something. Let's see what he does here and he goes for a Night Witch, that is absolutely fine. Royal Ghost is going to do okay damage against it, but more importantly we can now Mother Witch and get some piggies going. Going to also band it here just to protect the Mother Witch. Obviously the piggies are going to waste the daggers from his dagger dutches. So that's going to be really good for me. We have a huge counter push right now and we are going to take full advantage of this. Going for a little prince here as well. Battle Ram at the bridge. Go for a royal ghost here as well. Pressure him right now while his dagger dutches is low. Do we get an ability off? We do, that is fantastic. That is added pressure. Going to really stop this guy from doing anything. Go for a zap here on these bats. And hopefully this guardian ability can take out the entire tower because he's low on elixir. And that's exactly what you want to do with Pekka Bridge Spam. Pressure them when they are out of daggers and then you just take the entire tower so easily. And with this absolutely dominant performance, we just went 12 and 0 in this challenge. By far the best Dagger Duchess challenge deck. We do claim our banner here. And of course, I will show you guys my battle log. Just so you guys can see, I did go 12 and 0. I didn't do anything cheesy. Here's the battle log. Nothing but straight wins. What you love to see. And if you want to see more games, gameplay of this deck, check out the video above my head.